x minus 6 power x is equal to 4 power x. Find the value of x. So, at first we divided by 4 power x in both sides. So, divided by 4 power x divided by 4 power x divided by 4 power x. So, this 4 power x, this 4 power x will be cancelled. So, here on, here on. Now, from here we see x, x same power but different base. So, according to this exponential rule that a power n over b power n is equal to a over b bracket common power n. That means n, n same power but different base. So, according to this exponential rule that we can write here 9 over 4 bracket power uh, common power x minus 6 over 4 bracket common power x according to this formula then is equal to 1 divided by 1 that means it will be 1. Now, we can write here. 9 is same as 3 square over 4 is same as 2 square. Then bracket power x minus 6 can be written as 3, uh, 3 multiplied by 2 over 4 can be written as 2 multiplied by 2. Then bracket power x is equal to 1. Now we see this 2, this 2 will be cancelled. Now from here we see 2, 2 same power but different base. So remember this exponential rule that a power n over b power n is equal to a by b bracket common power n. So we can write here 3d over 2 then bracket common power 2. Then this first bracket it will be second bracket then power x minus 3 by 2 bracket power x is equal to 1. Now here we can apply this exponential rule that a power m bracket power n is equal to a power n bracket power m. So, according to this rule, we can write here 3 by 2 bracket power x, then second bracket power 2 according to this formula, then minus 3 by 2 bracket power x is equal to 1. Now, we see uh, 3 by 2 bracket power x, 3 by 2 bracket power x, both term is same. So, let 3 by 2 bracket power x is substituted by y. So, our equation will be y square minus y then is equal to 1. Now, we can write here y square minus y, then this plus 1 take to the left side, so this will be minus 1, then is equal to 0. Now, here we can apply uh, quadratic formula, so we can write here y is equal to minus b plus or minus a square root of b square uh, minus 4 ac divided by 2a. Here, a will be equal to 1, then b will be equal to negative 1, then c will be equal to negative 1. So, I can write here y is equal to minus b that means negative 1, so bracket negative 1, then plus or minus a square root of b square that means it will be negative 1 bracket a square minus 4 times a that means 1 
times c that means uh, negative on so bracket negative on then divided by 2 times a that means 1 now we can write here y is equal to minus times negative 1 that means it will be positive 1 that means on then plus or minus a square root of negative 1 bracket square that means it will be positive 1 then minus times minus that means it will be plus 4 times on times on that means it will be 4 then divided by 2 times on that means 2 now I can write here y is equal to on plus or minus a square root of 1 plus 4 that means it will be 5 divided by 2. Now we see here two cases so we can write here y is equal to on plus a square root of 5 divided by 2 or y is equal to on minus a square root of 5 divided by 2. But remember uh, y that means 3 by 2 bracket power x is substituted by y. So, y that means 3 by 2 bracket power x. So, y that means uh, 3 by 2 bracket power x is equal to 1 plus a square root of 5 divided by 2 or y that means 3 by 2 bracket power x. So, 3 by 2 bracket power x is equal to 1 minus a square root of 5 divided by 2. Now, we see uh, 3 by 2 bracket power any number is always positive, but 1 minus a square root of 5 divided by 2, this is negative. So, positive cannot be equal to negative. So, this is rejected because 3 by 2 bracket power any number is greater than 0, but 1 minus a square root of 5 divided by 2 is less than 0. So, this is rejected. Now, from here we take log in both sides. So, you can write here log of 3 by 2 bracket power x is equal to log of 1 plus a square root of 5 over 2. Now, uh, here we can apply rule that log m power r is equal to r log m that means this power r move to the base so according to this rule uh, i can write here x log um, x log 3 by 2 is equal to log of 1 plus a square root of 5 over 2. Now, we need the value of x. So, um, we divided by log of 3 by 2 in both sides. So, divided by log of 3 by 2 divided by log of 3 by 2. So, this log of 3 by 2, this log of 3 by 2 will be cancelled. So, here x is equal to this divided by this that means here we can apply rule that log a divided by log b is equal to log a base b so according to this rule i can write here log of on plus a square root of 5 over 2 then base of 
3 by 2. So, x is equal to log of 1 plus square root of 5 over 2 base of 3 by 2. So, this is the value of x. So, this is our final answer. I make videos with great difficulty. So, please like, comment and subscribe this channel. Thank you.